Hello everyone and welcome back again to Onhow channel. If you don't know, my name is NS and I'm working for you. So if you have any questions or any video requests, make sure to drop them below in a comment or check out my Instagram right here below me. I do reply to each comment as well as messages on my Instagram. And if you are wondering why is that, because simply I'm working for you. And in this video, I will show you how to add AliExpress products to your Shopify store in the correct way in five minutes including some bonus tips, which is how to find trending products on AliExpress platform because obviously the products means everything when it comes to your success in dropshipping. No matter how good creative or your store is, if the product is not good or it's not trending and winning products, you will not succeed. So finding a winning products, which means the trending products on AliExpress based on sales and so on, is the most important step in your dropshipping journey. And that's exactly what I'm about to show you in this video, including the second bonus tip as well, which is how to find faster shipping for the same product you did find on AliExpress. Then we will add it to our Shopify store. And all of this without using any paid tools or anything like that. All of the things that we'll be using in this video, you will find them in the description box and they are completely free. So without any more talking, let's just jump to it. As you can see, I'm accessing AliExpress right now, uh, which is the US version. And before I show you how to add products to your Shopify store, let me show you the bonus tip first, which is how to find trending products on AliExpress because as I said trending products is the key to success so in order to find trending products from the hidden place actually not that many people know about this location on AliExpress the first thing you're going to do is click on URL right here and you will need to remove .us this is if you are using the AliExpress US version if not just keep on .com in my case I need to add uh, .com and let's just remove all the W's W's and HTTPS and type in best just like you see on the screen right now in front of me. And as I said, I will also put a link for it in the description box. After that, let's just hit enter and it will show you this page right here. It looks really similar to the homepage of AliExpress, but actually it's not. Let me show you what I mean. So just scroll down a little bit and you will see this section says weekly days and below it, you will see top ranking section. On, on the right, you will see view more. Simply click on view more and it will show you this page with categories for each product and listed by the top trending just like you see right now so for example let's just go for the uh, tech ideas for college so simply click on it and it will open up a new page for tech ideas for college and smartwatch and rank it by the top trending so the first one will have the gold number and number one which is the ranked number one when it comes to tech ideas for college and smartwatches and the second one will have the silver color and the third the bronze color and so on and they are all ranked by sales and you can do the same for the other categories and you will find the most trending products for it and right now let's just get to the next thing which is how to add aliexpress products to our shopify store and this video will use a tool called zendrop which is a supplier for dropshipping and with it actually we will use it to find aliexpress products but with actually faster shipping and actually cheaper product cost as well so just open up a new tab and type in zendrop.com or just scroll down the description box and you will see it right there after that sign up to our account it's completely free you don't have to add any credit card numbers or anything like that uh, i already did sign up for the account so i'm going to sign in for my account and after that you will see uh, this message which is connect your store to zendrop and click on shopify and right here you will paste the handle or the shopify subdomain for your store so in order to avoid any mistakes let me head over to shopify and copy it from there so here is my testing shopify store so let me copy the url for it and make sure you do not copy the https and all of that simply the subdomain and let's just get back to zendrop and let's just paste it in here and click on connect and give it a couple of seconds and it will show you this page when you need to install the Zendrop application on a Shopify store. Simply click on install app and give it a couple of seconds and it will redirect you back to Zendrop supplier platform. And here we go. Just like you see, we can find any product that we want on AliExpress, but with faster shipping. And no worries, I will show you how to add the particular product, even if it's not available on Zendrop platform. So for example, let me do a sample uh, demonstration. Let's just search for a pet hair remover. And let's just pick a random product from here. And we will see the shipping time for it, as well as the cost. And we will compare it to Zendrop. Then we will add some product that's not available on Zendrop. So for example, let's just go for this one. So this one costs $2 per eight and the free shipping will be arrived on US in 21 May. And the time of recording this video is 22 March. So that's like two months. And even if we do select some premium shipping, 
as you can see this one will cost us two dollars and a half and it will be delivered in 21 april which is a month that's not really good so let's just hit back to then drop and search for here for pet hair remover and let's just hit enter and here is i think it's the same product so let's just check it out as you can see the product cost is actually lower it's just one dollar in here it costs two dollars so the shipping as you can see costs five dollars however it will only be delivered in 15 days and that's really good right so let's just get back and show you how to add a product even if it's not available on Zendrop directly to your Shopify store but we will use the tool that's available on Zendrop so let's just go to the home page and we will go for a random product from here let's just go for the sandals or whatever they're called so we want to add this particular product to our Shopify store including the pictures and videos and all of that so simply you need to do is copy the URL for the product let's just copy the URL after that hit back to Zendrop and access the find product section right here and simply type in some long text that doesn't mean anything basically and simply hit enter and it will say oh sorry we could not find any matches however below it you will see a port from aliexpress and that's what you want right so simply click on it and it will show you this message and we paste in in here the product url and click on import and give it a couple of seconds and it will say product successfully imported and it will take us to the import list for the product so we can edit the title or add tags on product type and collections and all of that and in here you will see description uh, with the description from the product however i do recommend you do not use description for aliexpress make sure you do write your own description and the variance for the product in here which is i think is the size yeah it's the size and the images for the product and for the images as well i do recommend you to download them from the page right here aliexpress product and compress them to make them lower in size so they do not affect your uh, uh, product page speed and that's really important because the loading time will be really slow if you did import all these pictures without compressing them and the last step in here which is click to import to store let's just click on it and wait for a couple of seconds and it will be imported so let's just hit back to shopify store and see if the product is actually imported or not so let's just get back to shopify dashboard and let's just check out the product and let's just scroll down and here it is as you can see this is the same product we did on port and with the small description that we did add as well as the pictures as you can see so that's how you add aliexpress products to your shopify store in the correct way as well as finding trending products on aliexpress and finding the faster shipping for your products and if you have any questions or anything like that make sure to drop them below in the comment or check out my instagram right here below me as i said i do reply to each comment and if you are wondering again why is that because simply i'm working for you otherwise i take my job it is done for this video so thanks for watching catch you on the next one